Hi, I'm Holly Silva and I've been a crafts expert for 15 years. Today I'm going to show you how to make a scary centerpiece craft. So here I have a foam block that I bought at the 99 cent store and just stabbed a whole bunch of holes into it. Remember, the cruder, the scarier. Think Texas Chainsaw Massacre, like just gritty and nasty. Okay, so now I have some little skull figureheads that I got at the 99 cent store as well. And with my X-Acto knife being safe, because I'm an adult, if you're a child, have an adult do this because we do not want anybody cut. I just slice some little holes into the bottom of the jaw so that these popsicle sticks can fit inside. Now you can paint the popsicle sticks black if you want to. I wanna, I like to keep them natural cause it looks really crude that way. Or you can paint them like silver or something and make them really look like, I don't know, they came out of like a junkyard or something. Ooh. But we're gonna keep this one a little, a little natural looking. Okay. Now here I have this piece of black foam stuff it's not paper, but it's foam. And I cut like a little rugged, rough tombstone shape out of it. And with a silver pen, I like silver because it'll show up. Uh, this is a silver Sharpie. It'll show up, but it'll be subtle. So white is gonna be way too bright and it's not gonna be scary. So I'm just gonna say, rip. That may be even way too nice. I should have maybe done it backwards or something. But there's always another side. So let's do this. R I P. Does that look scary enough for you? Okay, good. Now we're gonna do like, I don't know, 19, how about 1908 to did. How's that, huh? That is creepy. So now we're gonna take our double stick tape. We're gonna take two little pieces of double stick tape, excuse me. And we're gonna attach it to the back of your tombstone. And then we're gonna attach this to our two popsicle sticks. Right, and there it is. That is your scary centerpiece. Happy holidays. See you next time.